Hey, howdy, hey, friends. Trevor here with Dirksen Portable Buildings. And y'all, it is that time of year again. The days are getting longer, the sun is shining, the grass is greener, the temperatures are rising. That can only mean one thing. It's short season. I'm just kidding. Summer is around the corner. And what better way to clean up your backyard, whether it's from your winter toys or maybe pull supplies off your backyard, than with a Dirksen Metro Shed Garage. So Dirksen's Metro Series was created to fit into the urban and suburban backyard, designed to go up against a fence or even the back part of your house. Now the Metro Series come in a few different styles. You have the original Metro Shed, Metro Studio, the Metro Garden Shed, and finally your Metro Shed Garage. Now the garage comes standard with a five foot roll of garage door and no windows. You have an eight foot wall up on the front that slopes on down to a seven foot wall in the back, giving our nice slope, vertical style on for a roof that sheds water off nice and easily. But the garage is completely customizable to fit your needs. Whether you want to change the exterior and the roofing color, the addition and placement of windows. Shoot, you can even switch out your roll-up garage door for a 36-inch entry door or double shot build door. You can upgrade that floor to the three-quarter inch lifetime subfloor, or even add an electrical package to your building, giving a nice light and some added power. Now, like I mentioned before, summer's right around the corner, and what better way to store some of that pool equipment off your back patio or even in the garage in one of our Metro Shed garages. So let's take a look at the interior so you can see what that storage looks like. All righty, this is the last of it. Whew, I broke a sweat doing that. But there we go. We got tons of space. We got all the pool goodies. I mean, in this 8x16 model, you've got tons of space to do stuff. And you got your interior studs are going to be on 24 inch centers and they'll be doubled up where the paneling meets. But I mean, you can do your Metro garage shed in a number of ways. On the interior, you could add some shelves, maybe a workbench, add, upgrade that flooring, add that electrical package for a little bit of power and the light up the space, especially if you're coming out here in the dark. I mean, there's a ton of ways that you could use your Metro Garage Shed. How would you use it? Well, all righty, friends. I hope you guys are enjoying checking out today's video and Dirksen's Metro Shed Garage, the perfect backyard garage if you live in the urban or suburban area to put up against your fence or even the back of your house. Great storing anything from all your winter supplies to pool equipment. I mean, you can't beat it compact got tons of space there's a lot of ways that you can use the metro garage shed so if you're looking to you know maybe where you can find one or you want to know more what dirksen offers i got you head on over to our website at dirksenbuildings.com there you can click on our inventory and check out everything we offer then you can head over to the dealer locator so you can find a dirksen dealer near you now if you enjoy watching these videos you enjoy learning a few new things about dirksen products and you don't want to miss out on our videos Make sure you guys go like, subscribe, and hit the little bell so you get notified every time we post a new video. And follow us on all the social medias to stay connected with everything that is happening with Dirksen. Well, all right, friends, Trevor here with Dirksen Portable Buildings. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and checking out Dirksen's Metro Garage Shed. I mean, the thing is pretty awesome. Got a five-foot roll of garage door, completely customizable to fit your needs, whether you want to add some windows or maybe even an electrical package or changing the color on this building. Can't go wrong with this building. Well, all right, friends. Thank you guys for choosing Dirksen, and I'll see you folks in the next one. What a start. I actually have to go clean a pool now, so I'm going to take you for a plane.